There is what I would call, and what you call, breaking news about the Patterson film, the old Patterson film, the best film ever made of Bigfoot. And people have said, ah, what a fake, what a fraud. What do you say? Uh, there was something wrong with the Patterson film that bothered me more than anything else. And that was the irrationality that this lady showed when she walked away from two armed cowboys. She was within a sprinting distance of the woods. When I stared at it, and one of the things my, my mentor, Kai Nino Cochise, who died just two months short of his 111th birthday, wow. was a uh, full-blood Chiricahua Apache, he kept teaching me the Indian way, and he, by, by not telling me a damn thing, instead, um, leading me. And he kept saying, you're looking at the wrong thing. Look at, stop looking at her. You're doing exactly what she wants. She wants you to watch her. Look beyond her. Why was she willing to sacrifice or risk her life? Who was she protecting? So I began looking in the background. Accidentally, I get into this thing and I'm blowing up pieces and I'm on Corel 5 and I'm blowing it up and I'm looking, I'm looking, but I accidentally decided, well, the hell with this, I can't see this. I hit my, my printer button and I forgot my printer was black and white. Thank God it was. What I discovered when it popped out was not an ink blot. I started to see an actual form. So then I reduced the gray scale and I continued looking at the temperature of her skin and I was looking in the background and I discovered, first of all, a baby, a young one that is down next to a tree, has one hand curled up around the sapling and he's watching her. You're kidding. Then, to make it even better, I scanned ahead of her and I discovered a young male standing at a slightly awkward angle, looking not at her, but behind her. I think he is watching, not Roger Patterson, he's watching Bob Ginn. Oh, my. She was trying to lead the, 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 the hunters away, away from, from her baby, but she was leading them into a trap. So what was your immediate thought? You know, like, I, what am I, I looking at? It can't be, or whatever. Well, you see, I'd seen the drawings that, that different people had said that they looked like. And when I first saw it, I thought, well, yeah, they really do exist. But I had no idea whether... They, uh, and see, down there, I'll go back just a little bit. The reason Roger was called, there was three different sizes of footprints down there around this tank and it appeared to be a male female and a and a juvenile a male female and a juvenile 